Hello, hello guys, how are you doing? Today uh, I'm going to show you uh, introduction to ArcGIS Pro, which is the new version of ArcGIS, because the old version will uh, will uh, be retired uh, in 2026, after almost one year, right? So. It is it is it is it is very important to migrate from ArcGIS to old version today, ArcGIS Pro, which is the new version. So today we are going to see the introduction part of ArcGIS Pro. So you can open ArcGIS Pro from your this start button. Here you can open it from here. Go to here ArcGIS, and then from here the option you can open from here, or you can simply open from your uh, taskbar here right I opened it from here this is the first interface that you you that you get when you open ArcGIS Pro right uh, here this is you see here this is the home and here the setting and this new project area that means you are if it is your first time to create project you can create project if you have already created project you can open from this list and then if you need extra technical help or resource you can you can get from here and this one you can sign in and then to begin with you can create a new project click on this and then write the name of the project and you can select the location of your project this is my project and browse to your location of the project and in my case go to this uh, this PC and go to this A drive here I can create uh, <clears throat> a new folder here right you can create new folder or Simply you can access the folder that you have created, right? But here now I'm gonna to create a new folder for my project. You can create it here and they can say uh RJS, RJS Pro Project 2025. You can select that. And then uh, I can edit uh, this. Can add this oh, yes, folder. See, for your project, this project will be saved. Uh, this is the project name. Even you can change this project. That is your dissertation. You can say a dissertation project or any other name. For example, let's say this is the uh, uh, water watershed project. Um, you can you can say you can say by the way you can you can give any logical name. Uh, here let's say project lab. Project lab. This project lab. Okay, and then okay. Night is happening. Yeah, this is the graphical user interface of ArcGIS Pro, which is the new version. And here we have this. You see, this is the content in ArcGIS. It is the of content. Uh, by the way, uh, there is not this much significant difference. The only difference here, this one is more advanced than, one, uh, than, than that of the previous version. Automatically, if you are online, automatically it gives you the uh, <clears throat> base map here, like this base map. Uh, you can change the base map. Uh, I'll show you how to can change this base map. Here you have, you see, this is the content in ArcGIS it is called table of content and you see here insert and map if you go to map here you see here all the functions that you are familiar with in the older version are there for example here this one art 
and here select by select by select to select by attribute select by location here all are there right measure and this uh, find the location by typing in an address place name or coordinate value right all those are the only thing the difference one here you see here this is the base map you can select the base map right for example imagery hybrid that means with a place name with place name you can access this uh, base map like this it is satellite imagery and uh, uh, you can also add your data using this app button okay it is more of this one is for more of the uh, vector data analysis if you have raster data analysis you can go to here uh, analysis you can access a bunch of uh, a lot of uh, function is and you can go to uh, again to imagery or raster analysis it here gen detection raster function uh, function editor and all most of them are not active by the way they can be active when you add data right it can be active when you add uh, any raster data okay uh, right and the uh, other thing the the here you see here this Okay, let me start from this one. This is the uh, most important function. I see here the save project uh, and do redo, right? And this one is the new project. If you wanted to create new project again here, you can create or access from this one. And this is the menu bar, like that of ArcGIS. The main difference is the ribbon, the color of the ribbon. This one looks like that of the Word, Microsoft Word. But the previous one is not like this, right? As you know, it, it doesn't look like the uh, ribbon, ribbon of Microsoft, right? This is uh, uh, this one, the new version one, or ArcGIS Pro. This is very, very fast and uh, more uh, manageable than that of the old version. Here, for example, this is the project. You can click on it. You see, it goes to the project, okay? And again, here you can make it back to back to your already opened ArcGIS uh, Pro. And uh, you can go to insert if you want to insert what? If you want to insert new report or new map, the new layout map, uh, and uh, if you want to add folder or add toolbox, your know, toolbox. Right, you can go to insert and then you can go to analysis if you want to analyze especially suitability model visibility analysis exploratory analysis network analysis just partial or just statistical analysis and on right you can go to analysis and this one view which is very important one from this view you can access our catalog see catalog in all the version it is called our catalog but here it is called catalog pan and the catalog view you can see catalog view when you open it from here you can see here right mostly by default in the right uh, side it docked in the right side here this is catalog in our yes, it is called what the our catalog but here it is catalog pen, right? Uh, for example, if you open this one, you see it? This is the project that we have created, project lab, we said it, right? Project lab, you see? The project that we have created so far. Okay. Here it is, the project that we have created, this is our project, right? If you click this one, you go to portal. If you click this one, you go to computer, your computer. This, if, if it is your first time, by the way, this computer may not be uh, visible. So you have to go to this view and make it what? Make it this uh, catalog view. So when you make it this all active, automatically you can, you, can, you can access it from here. You see, for example, this PC. You can go to this PC and here, for example, your directory. You see here, you can see all these your folder and you can access your uh, folder automatically from this for example the one that we have created is the this one is that remember ArcGIS Pro 2025 this one 
that we have created, right? Here it is. And again, you can access it from here. Here it is. The folder, a, a project lab. Our project is project lab. And here our database already have created a project. The, the, the most important difference of uh, ArcGIS Pro from that of uh, the older version of ArcGIS is that once you have created the project, it saves all the important uh, database. For example, this is the database it created for your project, this database, and then it created a Arc toolbox for your project, right? So um, automatically when you uh, work on your project, automatically the output saved in this folder, right? No need of creating any extra folder and on, right? So it, is, it makes a very simple and easy uh, 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 analysis. Okay, the other thing that you have to know, you can access your processing tool again here. You see, your processing tool. Let us close this one. Let us come to here. Basically, you can close this. Cluster functioning, you can close again this. Can close this. A lot of things are there. Okay. You see, from here you can open. This is job processing. You know, job processing tool. All tools are there. You see, and then you can you can open this one. Can. This is all catalog, right? You can manage like this. Okay. And the most important command. Uh, before that, let us let us let us finish this one. The, the the menu bar. Go to edit in editing. You know, as you know, editing editing tool. Editor, you know, editor in the old version. Instead of <laughs> editor tool in the toolbar here, automatically edit tool automatically here uh, designed in the menu bar. Editor, right? Here it is editing. You can edit, you can create editing, uh, and you can modify editing, right? So this is editor tool, which is the powerful tool, as you know, especially for digitizing new data in ArcGIS, which is a very important one. And then you can go to MIDI for MIDI analysis. You see here, now raster functioning are open because already here, this is raster functioning because this is a MIDI. So change detection, right? You can open this change detection for change detection analysis. <coughs> if you finished your uh, uh, output uh, and the customize your map and in your uh, map layout, finally you can export or share your data on the web, right? Or on different. Uh, medias you can you can export it you can export them up you can print them up right you can print it or you can export it here by this shirt uh, menu and you can go to this help in order to get access help technical support or easy community diagnostic monitor learning resource and any help can access this one okay all right this is a simple a simple introduction to ArcGIS Pro thank you for watching next time uh, we'll see how how to uh, uh, make analysis on ArcGIS Pro